Okay, I'll start with Takwishi. <laughs> I will start with the easy part or the difficult part of your question. <laughs> Let's say the difficult part. My name, I can pronounce it in Dutch, like we used to do. That's Van den Broek. But I know the accent is difficult for English-speaking people, so I think Van den Broek or something is quite good. <laughs> I think you have to see the movie The Fugitive, where Harrison Ford has my name in the movie. So. Have a watch, <laughs> listen a few times, and you will pick it up uh, quite fast. On your first question, um, technology, it's in our world. Uh, we played with Cameroon twice against Zambia, so uh, I analyzed them. Uh, I know almost every player uh, that was in the squad for the, the last couple of games. I also have the games from the, the last tournaments on my computer and uh, the, the tournament of Morocco in January. So I have enough information at my uh, computer to know enough to continue the, the job. For the locals, it's a little bit different. Um, I have to watch a lot of games in the next couple of weeks. Uh, I will visit them all uh, live, but also I will look at Supersport or other internet platforms, enough games to watch uh, every team at least uh, live and on DVD. Um, I cannot say after three days in Zambia, but and I cannot judge the former coach. It's not my job. Uh, I will not do it. Um, but I will look into it. I think everybody has a chance with me. Everything is open, so I will check them uh, in performances. Maybe I can uh, give them a call, but for me, everybody can be called up. Uh, I don't gonna say I will do it, but at least I will give them the chance to, to prove themselves in games with their clubs. And if they're performing, they're welcome in the national team if they're motivated at 100%. Next question is, please. <coughs> do, you, do you think you are the right coach for Zambia? If so, why? I gonna answer the same things again. Uh, we will look into it. Nothing is proposed, not by me, not by their side. So we're going to have talks in the next couple of days to sort it out. Until now, uh, we didn't talk about it. Uh, on your other question, I don't think I'm the right coach, David. I think it's a, a question, a stupid question. <laughs> but I will answer it. I think I'm not, but I do my best. Okay? This is uh, just a... A small gift we are giving uh, Sven, but uh, we are also mindful of uh, the, the challenges our soccer fans may have with your name. I think you tried. This is a bit uh, of uh, a high level presentation. I think you gave an example of uh, the movie where they can uh, find uh, the right pronunciation for your name. But to our average soccer fans who are even uh, who start from as young as uh, three years old, I think Vandenbroek would be a big challenge. So we thought would make it easy, and uh, even just for the sake of uh, identity, without being offensive to you, we thought that uh, would present this to you. It's your name, the first name, and then of course. Football has got uh, numbers. So this is uh, what we've done for the benefit of our young supporters. Can, 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 yeah, let him hold it on. I think it's a good idea to make my name in some <laughs> <laughs> So this will be the easier one to for, for, for even you, the media, because when the group may be a challenge. But certainly, Sven, and uh, if it's very difficult, think about seven, but take out the E. <laughs> You're welcome.
can say one or two words so that we can close out. I arrived a few days ago and I have to say that uh, the welcome was very warm. Everybody I meet uh, la is laughing, is calling my name, good or wrong. I don't have a problem with that. So the first days were cold outside, but very warm in human contact. I hope it stays that way, that we have a good collaboration during the period I will be the head coach. And I'm looking forward to perform and to qualify for the FCON 19 with all the support and the support that the president mentioned in his speech. I think it's going to be a lovely journey the next couple of months. Thanks. My background, uh, I was a professional football player for 15 years. I made my debut when I was 16, a uh, very young age. Um, I had a career of 15 years. Stopped because of a knee injury, but I passed four years in Belgium at the highest league, six years in Netherlands. I went to Greece two years, one year back to Belgium and three years in Norway. Afterwards, I was one year out of football and I started my coaching career as an under-20 coach at the first league team in Belgium. I was assistant of uh, a Belgian coach in Greece and Belgium uh, with a promotion. And my last task, everybody knows that it was in Cameroon uh, with a Belgian coach uh, during the past two years. That's briefly my career. And I was a defensive midfielder or a central defender, but a smart one, not a physical one, but 